How are you doing? Uh, I just want to try to show you my uh, tiller. Just got to till this bit before I put in my crops today. Uh, last year was a bust. Dad didn't. Uh, plants were free, but it was like in August. And uh, if I got a tomato or two, I was very fortunate. So it's a couple of days from Memorial Day. So I'm going to be playing today. This tower right here, we were getting a bed, and I had my one shirt on. It was a very small engine repair. I said, oh, you repaired mortars. I said, yeah. He said, he don't know what's wrong with it. Yeah, the na neighbor uh, rebuilt the carb. Um, he put new coil on it, solid state, because originally it's points. So, that's a good thing. He went to pull it, and he said, it bet him back. So he asked me, well, do you want it? If you want it, you can have it. If you don't, it's going out to the curb. It's a craftsman, about 17 inch. Um, it says 12, 24, or inch wide path. So I said it says about 18 right now. And um, I'd, I'd have to guess because it does have points. It's in the early 80s. Because South State came in in 1984. So I'm thinking, you know, 1980 through 83 is what this teller is. My old man used to have just one just like it. So, took it home, put a little gas in it. He did say, say well, like just a little bit. I got to get some JB Weld. Can't tell someone else to try, try to, uh, right there. Uh, Got some JB Weldon, put that on. This one's leaking right here. Just a little bit, not much. But I wouldn't pull it, and when I did pull it, it the rope jerked out my hand. It was a rude awakening for sure. Well, when the rope jerks out your hand like that, what it is, it's out of time. And you got a flywheel key. Take this cover off, take your shirt clutch off, take the flywheel off. Boom. Put another flywheel key in, put everything back on, gap the coil. I always get the coil at 20,000s. Which is a business card. You just put a business card underneath the coil where the magnet is. Sit down and tighten it up. Turn the flywheel, get your business card, boom, it's in time. I did that. It fired right up. It started. You can see it did till. And right over here was just plain grass. So it all. Uh, Tilled pretty good. Well, the thing that I think what made it tell a little easier instead of like a buck and bull is that it rained about four days. So I just put, put a, about a 25 cent keyway in it. I buy them in bulk. I got a free tiller. Reason the this is, the air filter's not on, is, it didn't have, it had an air filter, but it didn't have the right one. I, I mean, the thing was so old that you had to take it and 
squeeze that and just centigrade in your hand. So I'm going to till it one last time and put my crops in. And I hope that uh, you guys have a great Memorial Day weekend. Have a good day. Bye.